All right, here's a call. Bobby, it's like 10 p.m. right now, but I just saw your story on Instagram that you told Caitlin that you love her. That's amazing. I hope you talk about it tomorrow. You answer that. You answer it. Don't be weird. No, say no, say yes. You don't just shake your head. Yes. Did you see that, Eddie? I missed it. Whoa! <laughs> I missed this. So is this real? It is. Well, if you're new to the show, I had never told anybody that ever. My whole life. Wow. And oh. so, but it didn't just happen. It happened weeks ago. Amy knows already. I wish she was yeah. here to talk about this because it feels weird to just talk about it with a couple of dudes. <laughs> yeah, wow. tell us more, Bones. Uh, I'm like, hey, right, Eddie, lunchbox. <laughs> you get down on the knee and say it? No, no, oh. no. But, um, yeah, that that's... Wait, can, that can, happened. can you talk a little bit about how you got to that point? You know, like how yeah, you... Yeah, I can tell you that yeah, yeah. I was finding every way to say it without actually saying it. Like, and I would say all kinds of things. Like, like what? You mean the world to me. I'm absolutely <laughs> crazy about you. I would just say everything except it. When I really meant it, It was, for me, it was just, just, just say the word. Uh, I can't, yeah. you get in my mouth. I couldn't, I just couldn't get it to come out of my mouth because, again, that was never said to me as a kid. Mm. I've never said it in that way to a human ever. I've joked around and been like, ah, I love you, man. But I've never said that to anyone. No, no girlfriends, no, no anything. And so... For me, it just you get in the mouth. It was tough. <laughs> but yeah, it was weeks ago. And what was the scenario? We were just watching TV. Oh, that's it. Because I didn't want it to be at oh. a big moment where I was just like yelling it or saying it because we were in the middle of something cool. Mm. I wanted it to be gra a grounded, I love you. And that's what it was. And so it was very just normal times, wasn't influenced by any big factor. And that's it. But listen. This relationship is so much different than every other relationship I've ever had. In what way? In every way. Like, the other ones were, like, elementary school, mm. and I'm in college now. Like, those other ones, they, they just, it, you know how you look back at high school relationships? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And you're like, eh, those don't really mean anything. That's what the every other relationship feels like at this point. So, finally, I had to just go, all right. And then someone asked us on our Instagram story. We were doing a QA and a on my Instagram. Mm-hmm. And they were like, and I was like, I'm just going to say it. Just tell them. So I did. I said, yeah, yeah. And then people lit up. Wait, wait, wait. What was her reaction? She fall off the couch. She start crying. And no, she... none of that. She said, I love you too. Duh. Oh, it was pretty simple like that. Like pretty like, oh, I love you. Okay, She cool. was just waiting for me to say it. I already knew it, by the way. <laughs> I just hadn't said it. And so she, was, she wasn't She was going to say it first because she knows my history. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So how was her reaction though? Was she it just was great. No big deal? No, it was a big deal. Of course it was a big deal, but it was, um, it was, it was great. It wasn't, we didn't throw a party or we didn't cry. <laughs> okay, yeah, but okay. did you, afterwards? Stop. Um, no. So, dumb. so yeah, that, that, that was it. Ray, how do you feel about that? Did you I, know? Yeah, I saw, I didn't know that okay. you guys had said that, but I saw the Instagram story and that just sounded like a very genuine moment. You guys were being honest. It recently happened and you did finally say it. Yeah. I wonder if she had told your girlfriend yet. But that's not something my fiance would tell me. You guys don't have the rule where there are no secrets. Well, and I don't. I don't deal with chick talk. Like. Me either. <laughs> I'm the same way. Chick talk. I don't, when she, they, she has her little girly girly talk, I'm like, you know, I'm good. Uh, I don't need to know any gossip. I'm fine. Um, Amy knew because I think Amy had been telling her for a long time because her and Amy are really close. And Amy was like, you know, he loves you. Relax, or whatever their mm -hmm, talk was. Mm -hmm. And so she went and told Amy almost immediately. And I was like, at least let me tell Amy. <laughs> Amy's been my best friend for years. Yeah. So, yeah, yeah. Hey, that's cool, man. It's pretty cool. It's a big, wow. that's a big deal. It's a big deal in your life. To, yeah, to, in my life it is. Yeah. I think most other 12-year-olds. <laughs> now, listen, I just grew up a different way than most people. Um, but yes, it was a massive deal. And, you know, this is just a completely different level of anything else. Nothing else even feels real except for this. It's about it.